This video describes the process of flashing a Bloom software image on a compact ticket dispenser, for both Bloom standalone and Bloom Enterprise systems. The right image must be provided by QBetter according to your system, there is one for Bloom standalone and another for Bloom Enterprise. Note that whenever you need to ask us for a new ticket dispenser image, you must provide the Raspberry Pi version details, or the ticket dispenser serial number. If you are going to flash the image on a micro SD card in use, you must turn off the device and carefully follow the next steps to remove it from the Raspberry Pi. Open the ticket dispenser with the key. From the inside of the ticket dispenser, unscrew the screw on the opposite side and remove the piece. Then, unscrew the screws at the bottom, on both sides. Lay the dispenser down with the screen facing up, and open it by pulling the top part. Unplug all cables from the Raspberry Pi. Then unscrew it, and remove it. Once you have your micro SD card, the first step is to turn it bootable with the image. In order to do that, install Etcher from Bayner.io on the PC. Please note that if you already have it installed, you don't need to do it again. Find the Etcher download link in the video description. Put the micro SD card in the SD adapter and plug it into the Windows PC. You can now run Etcher. And click on the flash from file button. Search for the Bloom image ESO file, and then click on open. If the image file you have, is not in the ESO format, you need to unzip it. We recommend you to use the 7-Zip software to unzip Bloom images. Find the link to download 7-Zip in the video description. Click on the Select Target button. Choose your micro SD card, and click Select. After that, click on the Flash button and wait for the process to finish. This may take a few minutes, so please be patient. Once the process is completed you will be able to flash the image on the ticket dispenser. From this step onwards, the process is the opposite of what we demonstrated at the beginning of this video. Insert the micro SD card into the Raspberry Pi. Put the Raspberry Pi back in place, screw it in, and connect all the cables. Fit the two parts of the ticket dispenser housing together. Screw in the screws at the bottom on both sides. Fit the side piece and screw it in. Plug the network and the power cables into the ticket dispenser, and turn it on by pressing the on-off switch. Wait for the reboot to finish. In the case of standalone, you will see the Bloom logo. In the case of Enterprise, the device information with two buttons will appear. And that's it, the ticket dispenser will be ready to be added to the system. 
Thank you for watching.